Master the art of English conversation with these 11 simple tips. Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel Daily Lessons, where we're dedicated to helping you master the English language. If you're new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss any of our helpful content. Today, we're going to share some simple yet effective tips and ways to help you master the art of English conversation. Whether you're just starting out or looking to improve your existing skills, the tips in today's lesson will be helpful and will have you chatting like a pro in no time. So if you are ready, let's get started with it already. 11 Uncommon Simple Tips to Help You Master English Language Conversation Tip number one, build your vocabulary. The first step to mastering English conversation is building your vocabulary. The more words you know, the easier it will be to express your thoughts and understand others. Try to learn a few new words every day and practice using them in sentences to reinforce your learning. Don't forget to learn synonyms for commonly used words, as this will help you sound more fluent and interesting. Tip number two, learn English through songs and music. One fun and engaging way to learn English is through songs and music. Listening to and singing along with English songs can help improve your listening, pronunciation, and vocabulary skills. You can even analyze the lyrics to learn new phrases and idioms. To get started, pick a song in a genre you enjoy, look up the lyrics, and try to sing along while focusing on the pronunciation and meaning of the words. Tip number three, practice speaking out loud. It's important to practice speaking English out loud even if you're alone. This will help you become more comfortable with the language and improve your pronunciation. Read passages from books or articles, narrate your daily activities, or simply talk to yourself about any topic that interests you. The key is to practice regularly and not be afraid to make mistakes. That's how we learn and improve. Tip number three, engage in online forums and social media. Online forums and social media platforms provide an excellent opportunity for you to practice your English conversation skills in a low-pressure environment. You can join discussion groups, comment on posts, or participate in chats related to your interests. This allows you to practice reading and writing in English, while also giving you the opportunity to learn colloquial expressions and slang that are commonly used in everyday conversation. Tip number four. Practice mindful listening. When learning English, it's essential to develop your listening skills. One way to do this is by practicing mindful listening. Choose an English audio clip, such as a podcast or a news segment, and listen to it multiple times. Each time, focus on a different aspect of the language, such as vocabulary, grammar, or intonation. This will help you develop a deeper understanding of the language and improve your ability to engage in conversations. Tip number five, use English to learn another skill. You may want also to try using English as a tool to learn another skill or hobby when if you really want to mastery in English conversation. For example, if you're interested in cooking, find English language cookbooks or cooking tutorials online. This not only allows you to practice your English, but also helps you learn new vocabulary and phrases related to your interests. By doing this, you'll be more motivated to engage with the language and improve your conversation skills. Tip number six, imitate accents and dialects. Another uncommon approach to mastering English conversation is to experiment with different accents and dialects. By imitating various accents, you become more aware of the nuances in pronunciation and intonation. This can help you become more adaptable in your speech and improve your overall communication skills. You can find resources online or watch movies and TV shows featuring characters with different accents to start practicing. Tip number seven, join conversation groups or language exchanges. One of the best ways to practice English conversation is by joining conversation groups or participating in language exchanges. Many cities have meetups or clubs where people gather to practice speaking different languages, including English. These events are a great opportunity to meet other learners and native speakers, practice your conversation skills, and make new friends. Plus, you can offer to help others learn your native language in exchange for English practice. 
Tip number eight, ask open-ended questions. When engaging in English conversation, try to ask open-ended questions that encourage people to share more about themselves or their opinions. This not only keeps the conversation going, but also helps you learn more about the language and culture. Examples of open-ended questions include, what do you think about? Can you tell me more about? How did you? Tip number nine, use conversation fillers. In any language, there are times when we need a moment to think or process what we want to say next. In English, using conversation fillers can help you sound more natural and buy you some time to gather your thoughts. Common conversation fillers include one, well, two, you know, three. Actually, tip number 10, don't be afraid to make mistakes. Lastly, don't be afraid to make mistakes when speaking English. It's completely normal and expected, especially for language learners. Making mistakes is an essential part of the learning process, and native speakers are usually understanding and supportive. Remember, the more you practice and learn from your mistakes, the better your English conversation skills will become. Tip number 11, listen and observe. To improve your conversation skills, it's crucial to listen to native speakers and observe how they interact. Watch English movies and TV shows, listen to podcasts, and attend local events where English is spoken. Pay attention to the way people pronounce words, use idioms, and express their emotions. The more you listen and observe, the more you'll learn about the nuances of English conversation. And that's it, our simple tips to help you master the art of English conversation. Remember, practice is key. So keep working on your vocabulary, listening to native speakers, and engaging in conversations whenever you can. Don't be afraid to make mistakes and always be open to learning from them. As always, thank you for watching. If you found this helpful, please give us a thumbs up and share it with your friends. If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, leave us a comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and also hit that notification bell so you never miss our latest English language learning tips. I will see you in my next video. Bye!